In the late 1880s, the city of Austin, Texas, was gripped by fear as a series of gruesome murders terrorized the community. The victims were typically young women, many of whom worked as servants in affluent households. The attacks were brutal and horrific. The perpetrator would break into the homes of his victims during the dead of night and brutally murder them with an axe or a knife. The first known victim was Molly Smith, who was found dead in her bed in December 1884. Over the next year, several more young women were attacked and killed in a similar manner. The killer's method of operation was eerily consistent. He would enter the homes through unlocked doors or windows, attack the victims in their sleep, and leave behind a gruesome scene of violence. The city was in a state of panic, and law enforcement was under intense pressure to capture the perpetrator. Despite a massive manhunt and the deployment of additional law enforcement officers, the servant girl annihilator continued to elude capture. The attacks continued, and more lives were lost. The case took a chilling turn when, in May 1885, the killer targeted two prominent white women, Eula Phillips and Susan Hancock, who were attacked in a similar fashion. This led to heightened public outrage and a surge in racial tension. Authorities began to suspect that the killer might be a person of color, and they intensified their efforts to apprehend him. As the fear and panic in Austin grew, rewards were offered, and citizens took matters into their own hands, forming vigilante groups. However, the servant girl annihilator continued to strike, seemingly without leaving any clues or evidence behind. The reign of terror eventually came to an end, but the identity of the servant girl annihilator was never discovered. The murders remain one of Texas's most infamous unsolved mysteries, and the story continues to haunt the city's history as a true horror tale of a serial killer who struck fear into the hearts of its residents. To this day, the identity of the servant girl annihilator remains a mystery, and the case serves as a chilling reminder of a dark chapter in Texas history.